I'm Joelle and you're watching Fluffy Kawaii Show and today we are unboxing together the swap that I did with Linda Lavalier and the theme is Harry Potter! <music> It's been a while that I did the haul to get the pieces and I showed you my three part videos of the pieces that I made for her. So I sent it to her and she had to open it before the Harry Potter Lolita event because she had received mine and hers was lost in the mail. So she opened it but she did not film the video yet. I know she will. And so now this is me having the box in my hand because I saw her last weekend and she actually gave it to me because she tried to ship it twice and it came back. So this is it, let's go. been spoiled by the customs declaration and it says what's inside and I'm oh my god she did a skirt I only shipped like a ring a necklace a brooch and a beret and the thing on the beret but she did a skirt oh my god I can't wait okay that's very pretty so first of all there is a letter that is sealed by a very cute washi tape. Okay, I'm gonna read it to you. Coucou, ma chère. Oh, I was gonna read it to you, but then it's all in French. So I'll read it and then I'll make a summary for you guys in English. Oh my god, so she said I'm super happy to do this uh, swap with you and she's trying to do a whole chord uh, in the theme of Harry Potter and Ravenclaw and there is supposed to be eight pieces in it. Oh my god, I feel so bad. I only had like four. Anyways, so there is a handmade skirt. She said it's be careful, it's not gonna be perfect, but I'm sure it will be awesome and a necklace and a, a ring that's representing the invisibility cloak a brooch from Albus Dumbledore so a crown like Rona Ravenclaw's a jewelry uncommon that has been made by her friend from Legend Descor and she was actually in the booth next to me this weekend on the convention in Animation and some kind of potion and she had to fight um forest a troll to get it and something that is really cryptic she cultivates it with passion she could be noisy but she doesn't ask for any care we'll see and candy but be careful some have a trap so basically it might be those harry potter candy that like it's either a good taste or a very bad taste. We'll see. So, I'm so excited. I was going to open this in my hotel room this weekend and I decided not to and I think it's a good idea. Because now I can make a great video dressed up and everything. Ooh. Oh my god. So, this is a crown. It's like a headband. And it's blue and gold, of course. Oh, it's super cute! So, it's those little pom-poms that I've seen her use already in other courts. So, I have pom-poms and a little chain here and a very small crown. That's very cute. Very, very cute. Yay! Ooh, they had numbers! Wait. What's that number? Okay, okay, this one doesn't have a number. I have number one here, okay. Let's open number one here and let's say this one was zero. Wow. Oh my God, it is a skirt. Oh my God, she saw me a skirt. Wow, and it has gorgeous 
the little ribbons here. Wow! So this is a brown skirt and it has blue like navy blue ribbons here with a small star it is gorgeous oh my god and i think that skirt would be perfect also to make steampunk cords and this is a very beautiful skirt oh my god Lynn, you're fantastic i can't believe it that's gorgeous oh okay and you have this here that you can actually Put it higher and you have the underskirt oh my god this is fantastic you're so good oh my god don't I have the best friend ever oh my god it is so detailed oh my god I'm gonna use this skirt definitely definitely and it's so roomy I'm sure it will fit yay thank you so much thank you so much it's really amazing so yeah, it will be awesome for steampunk and I could actually try to do a steampunk Lolita Ravenclaw look. That would be something fantastic. Yay! Oh my god! Okay, so this is number two. This ribbon is gorgeous and I'm definitely gonna use it to craft something. And a gorgeous, gorgeous gold box what's inside Ooh. I have an invisibility cloak ring when I read it actually it could have meant that um, she did not do a ring but it's an invisible ring but it's not okay so my fingers are so big that it only fits on my little finger but I think it's cute too because it's very simple it's very cute here and then I can put another bigger ring here very cool nice 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 it's very simple but very classy I like it and oh this is a choker oh my god today I was putting on a lot of dresses to film a bunch of videos and I was like I really do need a choker more chokers because they're cool and I don't have any and so I have now this navy blue choker with a small rose some a chain here and a very nice gold star yay awesome I'm super excited and it goes super well with the rest thank you this is number three so it is a book with Albus Dumbledore on the cover and it's actually a brooch or a hair clip with a very nice under brooch and two small flowers. It's fantastic and of course the flower matches the rest so I will have a very cohesive look. Amazing, amazing. I don't know if it fits in my hair or if I should put it maybe here. Yay! Thank you! It's so cool! Really, I never thought of doing that with books and everything and I've seen a lot of people at Omnia Vanitas actually crafting with books and it is such a good idea so that's really really cool! Thank you so much! The first one that I opened was actually number four. I just did not see the number, so I'm sorry. So number four, so now let's go to five. She said it's from Legend d'Ascor. So here's the business card. So I've seen her this weekend next to me and she is so talented, so talented. So she does gorgeous dresses and she said that she can't sell them because they are too expensive to make and she only makes them for her but she did a fashion show and every dress was gorgeous like high fashion gorgeous and then she makes very beautiful accessories so I can't wait to see it it is so pretty I don't actually know what kind of material this is but it's 
really 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 beautiful and there's flowers and leaves and so a butterfly and if I'm not mistaken it's something that you put around your ear I am not sure exactly how it works something like that maybe or if I'm totally mistaken and it's actually to be used somewhere else just let me know but anyways it is fantastically gorgeous so thank you so much Lynn for buying it and good job Legend Score because it's amazing 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 craftsmanship wow number six it is the potion she had to fight a troll to get it so It doesn't really say what the potion does, so I'll be careful and not drink it yet here in front of you guys, just in case. But it's absolutely gorgeous. It's it's beautiful. So it has glitter and the tag is so cute. Fantastic, fantastic, and I'll be safe. I won't drink it yet. Maybe later. We'll see. And number seven. Okay, so it does look like a plant, maybe. She said she grew them herself. Ooh. It is really kind of a strange mango, manga mangrave something like that i can't remember the name right now and you pull it off and then they cry you know what i mean so thank you so much and she said that she can be noisy but she doesn't require too much care so that's good and that's very good because i do not have a green hand do you say that in english i mean every plant that i take care of actually die so this one since it doesn't require so much care I'm good I won't make you die I promise because you might already be dead I don't know anyways please don't be too loud especially at night I would like to sleep thank you thank you very much and last but not least I have Bertie Bots Every Flavor Beans official Harry Potter candy they're actually jelly beans, but I suspect that they have very good and very bad tastes. So they actually do not give you a list of the different tastes. So I'm gonna finish up the video and then I'll taste one just for you and you'll see if I was lucky or unlucky. So, oh my god, what to say? Oh my god, she actually made me a skirt. Can you believe it? And not just a simple skirt, she did a skirt and another skirt and this this rough ruffles and she did that I have no idea how you call that that you can pull this part up to reveal more of the underskirt and she is the best. Oh my god. So, of course, you have to go see her video about her unboxing of my stuff. I will link it here and at the end and everywhere. But in any case, go watch her channel because she is a fantastic YouTuber and a fantastic Lolita. And Lynn is actually the one who organized the event this weekend. So with Rouge en Télé Rose Ruban West, she organized a whole booth of Lolita in Animasia and we had different sellers. They had a Lolita makeover and so that's a huge work and she's fantastic and I'm so happy to be her friend. So thank you so much, so much for everything that you gave me. You're fantastic and you go watch Lynn please and we have done other collabs this summer she transformed me in the classic Lolita and I picked her outfit with a blindfold so go watch those videos too that was really fun so I would like also to thank my patrons over at Patreon 
Thank you so much for supporting me and allowing me to make more videos. And if you are not subscribed yet, please consider doing so because I do a lot of Lodita videos, one every two days. So, see you soon. strawberry or raspberry something like that so it's a good one I think actually I'm thinking of a game like this so you play with two person each eat a candy until one eats a bad one and then the person lost I should try next time with someone <laughs>